So Paul, as he begins to speak to this king, I just want you to notice that he's going to use his testimony again. Uh, He's used his testimony on numerous occasions in the book of Acts, especially in these last few chapters. And I want to encourage you that your story, the work of Jesus in your life, can be an extremely powerful witness to other people. Don't be afraid to say, look, this is who I used to be, and this is who I am now because of what Jesus has done. Uh, Yesterday, I got to share with a young man uh, just very briefly at our Fishers of Men when we went out uh, to go door to door, uh, and I just had a small window, and I could tell he didn't have much time, and so I just briefly went through my testimony and said, I used to be like you. I used to be looking for answers. I knew there was truth. I didn't know what it was, uh, but I knew there was something beyond what I was personally experiencing in my life. And, and I told him I always felt like it was a, uh, this is, I always use this analogy, but I always felt like the blinds were closed in a bedroom, and I couldn't see past the blinds. Uh, but I knew there was something beyond the blinds that I couldn't understand, and I desperately wanted to know what it was. Uh, and I, of course, went all the wrong directions in life looking for those answers, and I participated in all kinds of things I shouldn't, looking for peace and joy and happiness in my life and looking for truth, and I never found it in the world. It was only when I came to the place in my life where I cried out to Jesus uh, that I found everything I was seeking in my life. Uh, And when I came to Jesus, it was like the blinds, they weren't just lifted, they were ripped off and thrown out of the way, and it was like I could see everything that I had been missing. It was all found in Jesus Christ. Uh, And so don't think that your testimony can't be a powerful witness of Jesus and his work within you. Uh, Use it often, because no one can take it from you. Uh, He has definitely changed our lives because of what he has done. 